of a young artist, Autumn De Forest, for a few years now, from age eight, she was dubbed an artistic genius and a modern master. Remember that little girl? She's now yep. 16 years old. Autumn already has a career that uh, artists triple her age can only dream of. I want people to say, huh, how did she, what tool did she use? Because you can't see the strings. Autumn DeForest first picked up a paintbrush at the age of five. The following year, she sold her first piece. By eight, the young artist sold more than $100,000 worth of paintings. Usually, I get inspired by an artist, by regular things, by ordinary, everyday things. Autumn has never had any formal training, yet she's been described as the world's youngest conceptual artist and an art prodigy. She even has a painting hanging in the Vatican. Now 16, her paintings have sold for a total of $7 million. I always want to uh, uh, continue learning and continue and, um, uh, empowering other people to, to, to do the art. So it's, um, it's what I want to do for the rest of my life. The amazing Autumn joins us now. So good to meet you in person. Thank you so much. It's, it's so wonderful to be here in Australia. And I just want to say thank you so much for your support over the years. It, I can't Aww. tell you how much I appreciate it. I'd also uh, love to thank one of my greatest partners and sponsors, Albert Scaglione, um, the owner of the Great Park West Galleries. Oh, OK. Well, welcome. It's good to have you here. Do you look back at all of that and think, where did I get this gift from? <laughs> Um, well, I just picked up the paintbrush at the age of five, and, and I just started, and I learned uh, soon on that I had a great passion for it. And then um, as I continued, I learned that I love talking to people about my artwork and sharing it and sharing the stories of my paintings to others. Yeah. When you're a prodigy like this, <laughs> and you start at the age of five, and you have an artwork hanging in the Vatican and all the success you've had, not to mention the mummy you've made. Um, is there a pressure to keep um, churning out is the wrong word, but keep putting out art that is magnificent? How do you how do you deal with or does it come naturally to you? Well, as an artist, I believe that it's always essential to continue to create, continue to produce, um, and then pushing that um, those pieces, those pieces of artwork out into the public and sharing that. Mm -hmm. But I think for some artists, that can be a little bit of a pressure to continue to create um, and continue to create masterpieces. But for me, it's just having fun. It's not it's not work to me. It's just expressing myself and um, expressing my feelings <coughs> on canvas. Do you have a vision? of what you're going to paint or does it sort of evolve when you have a blank canvas do you sort of somehow know what you're going to do beforehand or does it evolve um sometimes it can be um an evolution through the through the painting and and sometimes i'll start um with a you know with a blank canvas and i'll just start with different colors and see where it takes me um and then other times you know i'll have an image in my head um and i'll you know kind of um uh, use that to start the painting and then continue to Just evolve fun. on that. Mm. Oh, it is amazing. And we've been following your career yeah. and we will continue to do so. Uh, your paintings are just magnificent. Yeah. Thank so you so stay much. In touch and enjoy Australia. Thank you. It's so wonderful to be here. I mean, this is absolutely gorgeous and it's wonderful to, I actually just um, met with a group of my collectors um, and some of them were Australian and, and funny enough, they actually first heard of me from Sunrise. Oh, so, there you go. <laughs> Look That's at that. Fine. You're welcome. And our 10% will be uh, coming through. We're very cultural right. <laughs> here. We're very cultural here. Oh, um, autumn. Culture. Yeah, it's yeah, very cultural. Cool. All right, enjoy. Safe travels. Thank you Thank so you. much. And I actually, one quick moment, I actually have a gift for you that, oh. I, that I'd love to give you. Really? Oh, really? Here it oh. is. Oh, oh wow. wow. Autumn, that's beautiful. That, autumn, that is that incredible. <laughs> Thank you, you have it so much. <laughs> <laughs> um, this is actually wow. a panel from my Vatican series, uh, all done on a copper panel. I hand engraved everything and inspired by the pieces that I did um, that are now hanging in the Vatican Museum. You do copper as well. That is stunning. She's a genius. Beautiful. <laughs> Thank More. you so much. Thank Enjoy. You. Thank you.